Hello and welcome to another episode of this strange thing that I do on the internet. Today we are featuring Burger King. So two of my favorite things from Burger King inside, we get them out and we eat and talk and life is a thing. It's black hoodie, I'm back cooking these goodies. Look at these views from cooking these foods. Yeah. He's just a guy who eats in a beanie on the internet. Ooh, 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 ooh. Three is the magic number today. All right, so I got myself a little three sandwich feast here. What I was actually most craving was the original chicken sandwiches, the oval shaped, you know, Hey Arnold head chicken sandwiches. Those are what we're really playing on my mind. Uh, big time crave for those. And then you guys know that when I get Burger King, I just, I have to get a Whopper. So that's what we're doing here, okay? So before we do anything more, we must pour. Today we have a mashup of two different types of ice cubes because my ice situation was rather dire. And uh, I know I did buy, or not buy, but I got for Christmas an ice maker, an ice machine. I, uh, however, failed to turn it on earlier. So I had to make some emergency cubes for this video. We almost didn't pour today, basically, is what I'm saying. And in today's video, we are gonna talk about these knives that I won and the situation regarding said knives. So, um, you know, I'm just very impatient as a person and the process in which what is happening with these knives is very, it's just up in the air kinda. So, let's open a sandwich and then get into uh, what exactly is going on. On these, I requested extra lettuce and uh, the addition of tomato. And it seems as if that, yes, they pulled through. There you go. I love extra veggies. inside how do you feel about the Burger King original chicken sandwich from what I've heard in life or with people I've met it's a love-hate. Either you love it, or you think it's repulsive. I obviously personally love it. And they're usually a good deal. Two for five. So it's a lot of food for cheap eating. When I was in college, I always used to get the two, the two for five chicken sandals. couple times a week. I think I might like it better with just the lettuce. All right, 
move over into the Whopper territory. And uh, what's up with these knives? So let's get into the Bass Burger and tell you what's up with these knives. So good. I tell it's going to be amazing. So I like win the knives or whatever. And in the video where they announced it, they said, like, thank you for your video submission, Black Hoodie. They did spell my name incorrectly, though. Hoodie with the IE. And, uh, the, what you have to do is email him at his email claiming your prize if you were a winner. So me being jacked, immediately I email saying, hey, I'm Black Hoodie, blah, 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 blah. Thanks so much. few days go by crickets not hearing anything eventually Friday on like the 27th I think it was so on Friday the 27th I get an email from Sam the cooking guy saying congratulations we think what has happened is that more people are claiming prizes than there are prizes. So they don't know who is exactly truthful. So they need to be thorough to make sure everybody, the right people get their prize. So they say, can you give us your phone number? And in this next week, we'll set up a quick FaceTime just to confirm that you are the real deal. I was on Friday. It's Wednesday now. And uh, I responded with my, uh, my phone number and everything and said, yeah, FaceTime me. Anytime during the day, I'll be available. No problem. It's Wednesday now. I haven't heard anything back. So I sent another follow-up email uh, today just to see... if we can set something up just to check in and see where they're at now I get it it's the holidays it's busy I'm sure they have a lot going on so I'm sure they'll get back to me I'm hoping by the end of the week I'm hoping by Friday because at that point it'll have been seven days since my our last communication but it's just like A I'm very excited B I'm very impatient with things like this and C of course, like according to like how my life goes down usually with just things like this, it's like they always are more difficult than than it would imagine. Like it, you know what I mean? It never goes. It never just goes super smooth. There's always some kink in the program. So at this point, 
I'm just waiting to hear back or waiting for a random FaceTime call to confirm myself. So when I do get the knives, I think it'd be cool to kind of go over them, show you guys them. If you're interested in that, let me know down below. And uh, maybe in the style of like ASMR, I don't know, or like soft spoken, just like a very like chill Zen knife showing video. Uh, I don't know if you guys would be into that or not. Took the tomatoes off this one. And I can confirm. I do like it in its more simple form with just the lettuce. And the knife set is like pretty big, I think. There's like a lot of knives. So I think it would be cool if I selected a few knives to give away as well. I'll have to look at them and see which ones I could give away. But I think it'd be dope to pay it forward a little bit, extend a couple knives out to you guys. So I'll keep you updated on that. If I receive these knives, I hope I do. And then we'll figure out a way to run our own little uh, couple knives giveaway. Mm -hmm. It's better without the tomato. Somehow better plan. I mean, it was designed like that, so for a reason. But that'll have to do it for me for this one. I am full. And satisfied so hope you guys enjoyed that one uh hope this knife thing works out and then we'll figure all that out so till the next one you know what to do eat good live well stay true